Hi, good morning everyone. I just wanted to share with you uh, a few tips about wearing color. Um, this uh, past week was Easter and um, I wore a pretty bold and bright color for Easter. As you see, I am kind of reenacting it. I had on a bright yellow suit and I will show you another picture um, on the actual Sunday. And um, I wanted to show you how to accent your jewelry with it, as well as um, maybe I'll show you on the suit that I had a hat with it. Now, to start off, we're going to just deal with wearing bright colors and then complementing your jewelry. And then at the end, I just want to show you some really pretty colors and things we have um, for our season. Um, this is always um, Mila's Moments with tips on jewelry. And then we follow up with a, just a short segment if you're interested on different ways to wear jewelry and then um, let you know some items that we have with our line, I mean our Mila's jewelry. So um, what I wore was a double strand chain on Sunday with this suit. I picked up the gold that was already in the suit and I decided that I wanted to wear a gold uh, chain to complement it. So in wearing bold colors, you can do several things. You can complement it and um, stay within the color zone. You can go neutral where I have a black necklace and I also have a white necklace in this design. And you can go, and that's what I did, I wore a black hat on Sunday. So you can go with a neutral color that will kind of like, if I could use the word stabilize your color and give you like um, a balance to the brightness. Um, I have another necklace that I would like to show you later. It was just a clear necklace. Oh, here it is right here. Great. Um, it's clear. It's a little busy. But hey, it's springtime, and you see, it just is so transparent that it allows you to feel like there's nothing there. But because it's so um, beautifully designed, it does give you some more um, interest to what you're wearing. So you can go with a neutral, clear color. Um, if you want to go bold and spice things up, you can even introduce a um, a color that is um, on the color wheel it would be across from this color and so this would be a way that you can kind of um, go kind of accent and bring out you know your color and so don't be afraid to play with things don't be afraid to shake it up if you're more conservative then go down with you know you already have a colorful base but don't be afraid to have brightness even these um, blue beads that are like um like a seashell blue they would be beautiful with it you see you could go this way with it or you can go um really bright again across on the color wheel and you could wear like a lime green and so this would also be a way of accessorizing you have to know yourself so just wanted to show you a few colors that we have um we have this green necklace that is beautiful for summer. We have um, the same color in orange. And then, um, as I said, even with this suit, I would wear like a white. So we have um, orange and it has earrings. I'm so sorry. Let me straighten this up a little bit. Um, we have a beautiful orange for the season. And um, you just saw the other two colors. One fun, playful, we used this in a fashion show and I loved it. We have a playful chain that's just really fun and of course my favorite word I would use is funky. And this is um, like for an older person or for a younger person if you just um, want to, uh, for an older person if you want to have fun or a younger like teen, preteen. So um, here are a couple more pieces we have for the season. This is a beautiful purple with like gold running through. And then we have a beautiful similar necklace that's an aqua and it has um, solid chains at the bottom. So um, this one I can't wait to wear. I'm excited to wear it. Um, I'll probably show you some pictures when I wear this because it gives you just like a classic look at the bottom with a touch of color. So um, thank you for taking time. Um, this is a, just a one quick segment to show you how to play with color. All right.
you have a great Mila's day and I hope you enjoyed Mila's moment. And check out our website. I'll post it instead of saying it today. Bye-bye.